So initially in, in this project it was mainly uh, MTS and uh, myself, but then other people joined the the research team, such as uh, Rachel Erickson from Cardiff University, Nick White from Cardiff University, David Sivella, research collaborator from our university, Cardiff Metropolitan University, uh, Neil Stephens, also from the, with the sociological background, and uh, Tobias from Cardiff School of Art and Design. What we try to sonify is the experiments that they were setting up and the process of developing uh, stem cells. And surprisingly, surprisingly this took, looked very similar to the way we organized sound objects or we organized sounds because both are time-based activities with precise uh, um, you know, methods and also we, we try to make uh, a parallel between the sound of music, like processes that happened in music, orchestration, counterpoint, with things that they were happening in stem cell production and, and it worked, it looked similar. We, of course both were applied in different fields but we show the similarities, there were very similar processes surprisingly and how you visualize the process was similar. So the, the making process came naturally in a way that uh, we were both all, all of us were based in Cardiff, so we used to meet regularly in this university or in the other university, exchange ideas and develop the design and experiment also a lot with sounds and quick on-the-fly programming. So we would meet like every three weeks if possible, um, discuss about our findings, develop further the concept, present some sonification examples, present, present the the code, which was an essential part of this project, and it took us a while, and move on. The, the, so the, the challenge, and always the challenge in those type of projects is uh, people talk different language, like different disciplines talk different language, so it took us a while to understand and in order to communicate what signification, how can music enhance the research in bioinformatics, that was, I wouldn't say difficult, but it was challenging. But in, in the end, I think it was a mutual understanding and respect, and that's the most important thing, and it worked. So after a couple of months of, especially in the end of intensive preparation, there were many things to coordinate. And in the very end, we did a, uh, I feel a lovely presentation with the Cardiff Gamelan Ensemble, where I composed a piece for them and also had another musical composition coming from David Sibel. And it, it was, uh, for me, it was an exciting and brilliant finale because uh, we reached a point that we could share our findings and we create something which was aesthetically, I find it aesthetically, you know, elegant and communicative. So people were, the crowd were mainly scientists and we got nice feedback, so it felt nice. It's always nice to finish with a nice performance and presentation.